So this mid-transfer rescue, you can do a lot of playing around with it. It's also called a loop rescue or a large re-anchor rescue. Um, there's, a lot of, there's a lot of variables involved. Ideally, you want to keep it as simple as possible. If it's a loop, you want it rigged for rescue so you can lower it out. Or um, if it's a mid-transfer rescue like this, then ideally we just want to climb up, climb up this side, operate his descender, and we'll take him this way. And then we can recover him and bring him down. It's very easy. What we don't want to do is what I'm about to demonstrate because it's a last resort and it's really hard work. We would only do what we're about to do if you had to take him that way. So he's a cent on a scent on this side and descent on that side and we were trying to get him back to a platform or back to a structure that was that way, okay? Because it's very hard work, it's very complicated and it takes a long time. So in this situation, my casualty has come off the tower or under deck or whatever and he's roped to roped out and I want to take him back to the tower without any additional ropes. If it didn't matter which way we took him, this would be really easy. All I do is unlock that and we go that way, okay? You only do this if you have to take him back that way. The first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put an extra descender in, into my D-ring. And I'm gonna get my hard link ready because when these two descenders are split, it's difficult to get it in. in there right and then I'm going to put my new descender onto my casualties backup line and what I want is to be level with his chest ish without without giving him too much of a hard time. Right, so I've got two descenders now. Now I need to sort my backups out. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna join us together with a soft link into his waist. And then I'm gonna put my hard link <coughs> into his chest and that'll get him Nice and upright as well. Keep his airway open. Right, and now we're joined together. So I'm gonna take his back up off. And I'm gonna put that up here. Just take his hand ascender off. Right, so I've now got two descenders, two backups. I can go either way if I want, all right? Uh, I'm just gonna, all that was doing was so I wasn't loading the L57. So I'll just take that out. All right, I'll take his other backup off. So it's similar to a loop rescue, this as well, but we don't really like loops. Shouldn't be doing it. That goes into there. Right. So I just need to get him off his kit now. So you think, oh, well, that'll be easiest. Don't want to do that one first. I want to do this one first because um, it's quite a lot of his weight's on the descender. So you could always see how much. Oh, will I get it? Probably not going to get that. All right. So we need to get him off his crawl. So we're just going to do a quick counterbalance. So basic on. Sling into his chest, up through there. Just make sure it's all tight. I mean, there's not, it's not massive that, it's just to get him off that. Right, so we can now go either way. I may as well take him off his descender for now.
Right, so I've now got him on me. I've got two descenders on. So if I want to go back to the structure, I can do. I just need a basic and a pulley or a hand jammer and a pulley. I'm going to take my working line up through this. This is a last resort. You really don't want to be doing this unless you have to. And then we can start to ascend out that way. Put my jammer on. <coughs> Put my foot in and then, yeah, you've just got to do your best with your casualty care while you do this. All right, so I'm nearly there, I'm sweating. I've kept this one quite tight, so that before there was a bit of weight on this one, so all the weight wasn't on this one, so it should make it a little bit easier. Keep going. And it does get hard when you get close to it, you've got to pull him up at the same time. But then once you're close enough, I can strip this out. Last little bit off that one. And then hopefully your mates are there to help manhandle him back in. As I said, you only want to be doing that if it's a total last resort. Really, you want to go that way. <laughs> 